Okay, so here's where we are. Blades. <clears throat> uh. Ruin of accuracy. Yeah. You know what? That's fine. So much junk. All right. Two daggers of the four winds. I'm not giving up at all. Alright. Pretty magic. Alright. You know your way around a weapon. That being taken care of, I think we'll just use the final thought. Why not? I got it. Buy something. Here you're having problems with the bone pit. All right. What's this bone uh, pit you have a problem with? Wow, Hubert, you look ugly you look with this overhaul. You always had hair do. when I last saw you. I had to suspend operations. My workers are lost in the mines or have run off. Served me right for hiring Ferelden refugees. I sent others before, but no word. Perhaps they are putting me off. I need someone competent to figure out what is going on. What's the reward? I will pay handsomely. The exact amount depends on what perils you face. Your first mistake was naming your mine the Bone Pit. The locals named the mine. Eh, well, that was me. There wasn't cursed. some. There wasn't any fireworks outside, though. Trust me. It may be dull -witted, Speaking but of which, I actually got to celebrate the Fourth of July. And by the time this comes up on YouTube, you will have no idea what I'm talking about. Mind what you say about my countrymen. Yeah, buddy. I was not referring to you, of course. My workers are a particularly desperate sort. They're lucky to work for me. Few in Kirkwall will hire refugees. Also, were you always this white? Some of these white, some of these mods whitewash people on it, people either intentionally or unintentionally. This is kind of air. Yeah. You said some of your workers are Ferelden. Of course. Who else would be pathetic enough? Yes, all of them. An unruly lot, to be sure. Surely the miners had good reason to leave. I am at a loss. No miner has reported in, and no one takes me seriously. The bone pit must be dangerous if people are afraid to venture there. The logical conclusion to draw from it. Be no heed to local superstition. The bone pit is mostly harmless. I'll head there soon. I'm not doing anything else right now. The sooner the better. Each day the mine is not running costs me more than those miners make in a year. The bone pit is just outside the city. Any map will show it. And Hubert's fine goods are mostly not something we could really need. Oh my god. A Tome of Technique. Huh. 
Well, what else is going to spin it on? All right. <clears throat> Now I'm gonna do what I said earlier and actually huh. I think you let this get away from you. You just stumbled on this? Can't say I'm surprised. Bloody fools. Alright. Alright, let's enchance my uh armor. Berry rune, fire two, sword two, protection. It's very easy to want to do that. So. For the most part, are weaker in Dragon Age 2 than they ever were in Dragon Age uh, Awakening. More or less. Like, I didn't use the runes much in Awakening, and the armor runes for the most part are kind of nuts, but even if you don't use the extra armor rune slots like I did, if you don't use the mods to give yourself more rune slots like I did, you can still. Find yourself using miners must be a desperate lot to work here. That's easy to destroy everyone's life. Destroy the outlaw bearded beast. All right. Um. There's work here, but I wouldn't call it paying work. You ready? I'm ready. Alright. Woo! Final Thought. So, for the record, the Final Thought is a Tier 3 item, or piece of equipment you normally cannot get into the Act 3 of the game, but because of the, you know, pieces of 8 mod we have, we can get it in the first act and actually use it. As a weapon, you can tell why it's top tier. For a mage. But the root of striking, giving myself 7% more crit chance, is definitely... Uh, 
allowing me to put in more work of it with the uh, basic auto attacks than normally would be able to. In fact, I would dare say that the most vital thing that weapon ruins gave you in Dragon Age Awakening was having your weapons get additional melee crit chance and additional melee critical damage. After that were paralysis runes for rogues or basically everyone else in momentum runes. Basically, the weapon runes were a lot better because on the weapons, you got more DPS no matter what direction you were going in. But the armor runes are kind of basically... Like, you saw me so basically solo the Harvester on Nightmare because of all the additional dodge chance armor runes I put on my main character. The entrance to the mine. Perhaps we'll find the missing workers within. I think so. Ah, uh, Bethany, I should probably just get into rock armor. I don't know. Looks like a fight. Be ready. Let's make this quick. Get back. I should also remember that um, I do have potions to use, but yeah, in general, all the runes have the pro like the elemental resistance runes scale with the quality of the armor. So if the armor is already at a high enough base level, it'll be pretty worthwhile. But if the web if the armor itself scales in level, then the defense values in the armor will also scale in level. But for the most part, the uh, elemental defense runes really don't matter because they require you to already know ahead of time which uh, element using bosses to prepare for. And if you already know which elemental using bosses to prepare for, you probably have some other strategy in mind that isn't, like, tank damage and make sure your party doesn't get destroyed by elemental defense. Are you serious? Carver, move. Be now, careful. as for what we're even doing at this point in the story... Like I said, um... At this point, there's no story. Four magic, nature and bonus nature and spirit damage, chance to regenerate mana stamina, and additional mana stamina on top of that. The main reason we're using the final thought is the insane amount of nature damage we can deal. Now we fight. That's enough. Let's finish this. Now you fall. Because unless you're playing a nightmare where friendly fire is a serious concern, there's no real point in like paying attention to There's no real point in like paying attention to your party member's elemental defense. And especially in the early parts of the game, runes don't matter that much, offensively or defensively. It 
Hey, what's up, buddy? Nice and trusty you came along. Them dragons would have sniffed me out for certain. Slow down. Tell me what happened here. I'll tell you what I can, but be a friend and keep your voice down. There's another dragon close by. Where did the dragons come Really? From? That's new. I was mining a new tunnel when the wall collapsed and dragons came through. There was a bloody slaughter. Scared out of my wits. I ran like my ass was on fire. It probably was. Only I went the wrong way. Ended up trapped here. Did anyone else manage to escape? Some of my fellows ran for the surface. I hope they made it. You better get going. Try not to get eaten. Don't have to tell me twice. You should leave too. But don't go that way. There's this huge dragon. Seems we've another dragon to slay. Here I was hoping to get back to Kirkwall in time for happy hour. Yeah, we're we're fighting a dragon right now. Hi, dragons. Oh, I don't want them to go extinct. <laughs> eh, nah. Eh, nah, nah. That's a little too sad. I'm not a fan of that type of thing. I just don't believe in it. But what? All right, here goes. Massives. Here, eat my powerful blood magic. We're just pounding on you. Wow. Holy crap. But yeah, the mature dragon is taken care of. Dragon's Fang is a lot item. Belt the Chase End, the Martial Thunder, Enchanted Gloves. Well, a mature dragon is certainly an issue. Don't get me wrong. It's a big problem. But that's it for us for a reason. your problem so what happened one of the miners told me you rescued him from dragons I cuffed him for lying well he wasn't go there and see the corpse yeah man phone. come on you're a terrible uh, excuse for a boss I thought they're extinct <clears throat> I believe you you thought dragons you the thing this the current event. age is named they after were extinct to work I got all the dragons. Should be safe enough for now. Let us discuss your payment. You have been a great help. Since you did so much more than I was expecting, how about we work together? Work together? With him? I am offering a 50-50 share in the mine. Nah. You will make us both rich if you can keep your countrymen safe. If you want my help, you'll pay for my services in advance. You're both tough and shrewd. Very well. I had some money set aside for safety equipment, but it is yours instead. So, to our first order of business, we replace the lost workers. I will hire new hands. Plenty of desperate Ferelden's out there, but it will take some time. I need you to convince the surviving miners to return. They are holed up in Low Town. Tell them the Bone Pit is safe again. I'll see what I can do. Alright. Yeah, being a shrewd hackler gets Varric's approval. 
All right. Let's get you people back to work. You work for me now, so you don't have to worry about your terrible boss doing terrible things. Also, I just have to say for the record, the good thing about playing Dragon Age 2 is that it does not have Dragon Age Origins save leaking issue. So I can play as long as I want, but I don't have to like turn the game off after every one to two hours just so I get reasonable loading times back again. It's a that's like the one of the best things about going to Dragon Age 2. I'm not a fan of the game. I still vastly prefer Origins, but if I have to play the game, I'm gonna play it modded. I'm gonna play it. And enjoy the fact that it has better load times. Hey, Jensen. Hey, this the one that rescued me from them dragons. A fellow for Elden, no less. You're so big. Oh, eyes on her face, you lush. A thousand thanks for saving Jensen's worthless hide. Worthless, am I? My farm supplied eggplant half of the South Reach. Yeah, my eggplant supplied half the bastards in South Reach. <laughs> You're a real hero. Now what brings you here? I killed the dragons. It's safe to return to work. What if there's more dragons later? Or something worse like, uh, bigger dragons? I go back to the missus without this job. She'll rip me apart sure as any dragon. What can we do? That bastard Hubert is the only one willing to hire us. Yo! Would you go back for twice your previous salary? Wow. Well, I... I trust this tease, Chance, and take it. We can drown our sorrows every night. And not with his dark town swill, either. Back to Man, work. I wish my I boss would literally hire me back by gift. Pay me twice I usually worked. That would make me incredibly happy. Armor, the armor stand. I don't need a I don't need the rune of fortune because we make so much money it's not really necessary. All right, swarm does nature damage across? Alright. Alright then. Yeah, we got the point of the key. Red Water Raiders are the third gangsters we have to take care of. Let's finish this.
it's pretty nuts we're already level 14, because for reference, if you do all the content you can in Act 1 of the game, you'll be lucky to hit level 13. But then again, we're playing with a level 50 mod, so decreasing the amount of experience it takes to get to level 50 makes it very certain that we'll hit that level. Now that line of Carver is right there, he can actually say while you're technically still running away from Ferelden by going to Lothering. He can say it in the prologue of the game. A little oversight for the developer's team, I imagine. Man, the water looks awful. I'm sorry. The, I know the engine for Dragon 2 here is... Well, it's terrible, frankly, but... Still how bad the war looks. I'm surprised there isn't a mod that makes the war look genuinely better. It looks like glossy cloudy jello. If that makes any sense. <coughs> like Dragon Age 2 and Skyrim came out in the same year, and the difference in how much there is to change, it's like night and day. I lost two of my men for damned wheat. If it flies amaranthine colors, you sink her. Careful, Lick Spittle. My men and I aren't accustomed to taking orders. The Viscount's pardon comes with strings. If amaranthine is left unchecked, they will rule the Waking Sea. Piss on that. What do I care? A dozen war galleys hunting your kind to extinction says you'll care. Uh, sir, someone's nearby. Looks like a fight. Be ready. Huh. <laughs> sorry about that. Hey, what did you corrupt God? Well, eh, okay. This is the best we could do from right now because we had secret rendezvous, but I guess we'll take care of that when we get uh, right now. For hours. Get another drink or get out. Someone powerful in Kirkwall wants the raiders to attack Amaranthine ships. As I suspected. You've earned a bonus. You've done Ferelden and Amaranthine a great service. You get that quest if you help save Amaranthine and Awakening. Really. It's basically just it. <clears throat> Now we do the same for Isabella's person. <coughs> so you found me. Going to finish Martin off properly this time, are ya? Where's my property, eh? How does it feel making a profit off someone else's hard work? 
Not speaking from personal experience, but I'm sure it feels great not to have to work to earn your keep. You bastards. Well, I'm not going down without a fight. Bay, whoa. I'm not who you think I am. And I'm certainly Yeah, not it's called humor. Take a You're joke. You're not trying to kill me. Huh. Makes sense. If you were, you wouldn't be talking. Yeah, 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 yeah. This could yeah, turn out well for both of yeah. us. You're not, you're not here to end me. You're you're Maybe you could but help me instead. I need someone to help me find out where the raiders have hidden my stolen cargo. This job's as easy as a peg-legged tavern wench. And there's good coin in it to boot. You have a history with the raiders. You used to be a raider. That means yes, you used to be a criminal. I was a raider. Back then it was just smuggling and petty thievery. It's changed since that madman Ianto took power around here. Extortion, murder, kidnapping. He does it all. It's just not to my taste. I tried to get out, but he didn't like that. This scar on my neck? He gave it to me, slit my throat, and threw me overboard. I tried to start a new life away from this bullshit. And he has his men chase me down and steal my cargo. Sounds like trouble you made for yourself. Why would the raiders want your cargo? Is it valuable? How should I know why they want it? It's just spices and herbs. Nothing special. Huh. <sighs> right. People want spices and herbs this badly. We don't need to know what exactly he's lying about to tell he's lying. What did the raiders do to you? They closed in on my ship and forced her into the cliffs. My crew and I barely made it out alive. Yeah, I like Dragon as, as well. Um, a Reaper 45. I really do. Are the raiders a big problem around here? There are always raiders on the seas, just like there are always bandits on the roads. But they've been much more active of late, like vultures taking advantage of the blight. All right. All right. So, I'll take care of it, buddy. I'll take care of it. You'll need to look around the docks. The crates bear the seal of the Orlesian Port Authority, so you'll know it when you see it. You're assuming I know what Come on, man. I'm from Ferelden. <laughs> it's fancy. Just like everything all easy. I've had it with the Raiders. And this cargo is the key to me getting on the straight and narrow. You're doing me a huge favor here, friend. Thank you. And be careful. So this is basically the business hour. Okie dokie. Look at all I think you let there this you go. get away from you. You're a beast at law. Long since paid my debt over this. It's grand to see it again. And yeah, those This is like Mass Effect 2. Sometimes we'll get an item to find Mass Effect 2. Yes. <laughs> Good day to you. And that is quite literally the long and short of what we'll do.
Alright. The alienage is overcrowded. Someone should do something about it. Beats the minds. That much I know. No pay for slow work. Alright. Alright, let's take care of this since we're here. Now we fight! Lord Haramont, what do we do with the human? Stand down. She's not our foe. What was that about? Assassins. The boat to Ravain is within sight, but the Carta would see me dead before I get there. How would you like to make some coin? I've never seen a dwarven lord. You still haven't. If you're looking ah, at nice AI, input there. He's not a lord anymore. I'm Renville Haramont, the last of my house. My family was once revered in Orzammar. Now I'm nothing but a surfacer on the run. Mm hmm. You must have. Hey, what are you up here for, Lord Haramont? With so many witnesses around. My family was murdered one by one by King Balin after my uncle failed to claim the throne. Balin's reach is long, and his vengeance a terrible thing to behold. <sighs> sure. I mean, I know friend of the Carta. Dwarven politics do not concern me. I'll clear the way for you, Haramont. Dispatch these ruffians and I'll pay you what I can now. And by the ancestors, I will reward you proper when I am safe. What is your name? Hawk. A good name. I will remember it. The Carta has several groups lying in wait for us. Take the battle to them. Like, if my warden were doing this, he would absolutely just finish off the rest of the Haramont line. He picked Balin for a god dang reason. Haramont spoke to you, didn't he? Whatever reward he offered, we'll offer you more to kill him. Better be a lot more than he's offering, Dwarf. The purse will be heavy indeed. Then Haramont is a dead man. Paramount can't wait forever. Um, I actually didn't need to do that. Well, okay. Well, that's a little embarrassing because I wasn't actually going to do it. It's funny that you can immediately do that. So here's the gist of it. Role playing wise, what you can do is take the good path and get a minor reward now and a better reward later. In the game. I think you let this get away. Or you take the bad path and take a greater immediate reward now but lose out on better rewards later on. This your brother. Looks like a fight. Be ready. Yes. Hello? How would you like to make some coin? Now I'm nothing but a surface. Balin's reach. Alright. Alright. Uh I might as well get everything. Yeah, that I cost myself some time there, but whatever reward here. Schubert, be careful. Ah! Find them up. Let's finish this. I can't move. Uh. There's more of them. I can finish this. Done. All right, but no thanks. I seek any information on suspected impostor. Let's see. Uh, secondary side quests. 
So secondary, Gizli, missing wife, Lucky Martin, Storm Kyle, not by day. Alright. I think the canary is smiling. Now we fight! Now what you saw there was a cross-class combo. New to this game. Uh, basically, any two warriors, mages, and thieves that don't have certain abilities that. I'm looking for some cargo. You're in luck. Cargo all around. Take your pick. A laborer with a smart mouth. You hardly ever see those. What do you want? I'm looking for crates sealed by the Olesian Port Authority. I haven't seen any. Sorry. Talk to the Arbor Master. Oh, I'll bet he's got information about your cargo. He's in his office. Hey, if you're done wagging your tongue, can we get those sacks like off the docks? Yeah, all right. Alright. All right. Not a favorite stop. Ugh, Kunari themes are playing right now. All right. But yeah, cross class combo basically certain abilities will combo off of other abilities after they're upgraded. And by doing that, like for example, if I set an enemy, if I freeze an enemy solid with Winter's Grasp or Point of Cold, then with those upgrade abilities, there's a chance that my warriors were able to use their warrior towns to deal bonus damage to enemies and create a brittle combo. That's the most basic one and to be honest the system is kind of one that depends on you basically knowing Oh, a shady merchant. Just don't ask where anything came from. Oh. Alright. Uh, commissioned. Antom Tar Eva. Okay. Ring, fire, blood, tinge, lyrium. Evading and disarming traps increase the chance of finding quality equipment. Oh. Interesting. For the record, the extra runes I'm finding uh, do not exist in the vanilla game. They are from another mod. 24 additional runes in total. Andraste's grace be with you. Have you seen an elf about? Short, blonde hair, slight build. Shipping manifest. I'm looking for cargo bearing the seal of the Orlesian Port Authority. Ugh. Adam, deal with this. I apologize on Liam's behalf. He is a very, very busy man. I'm Adam, the Harbour Master's assistant. I understand you're looking for Elysian cargo. I have seen the crates. I can't remember where. Such a shame. I can't imagine what you mean. The clink of gold coin often jogs my memory. They say your life flashes in front of your eyes before you die. You're not going to kill me in broad daylight. No one's that stupid. <laughs> yeah, basically, your per your persuasion checks are limited to your... Pers to your hawk's personality, basically. If you're... Mar if your personality was more brutal and you constantly pick the renegade options. Is 
Is this enough to help you remember? You know what? Ah, it's coming back. <sighs> Fine. The cargo is in Alton Woodrow's warehouse. By the dock. I'm glad we could help each other out. The maker guides my hand. That's basically just the best I could have done, though. Guys, what else we're supposed to do? <laughs> just waiting on a good ship, my battle. I wager you've a bright future ahead of you. Take this. More will come, as promised. May the stone look after you. Yeah, I'm sure your stone's a very significant thing, but... Oh, you can't get rock armor. That sucks for you. Alright, um... Go for binding. Go for repulsion. Sure. Uh, I'll get you. Never going near a ship again. Someone coming. Tell the this is private property. What are you guarding? Imported goods. Who owns this warehouse? Really? Master Woodrow, I suppose. It's rented storage space. I must have taken a wrong turn. Hmm. Be off with you then. This is private property. Let's see what's behind that door. No visitors allowed. Um, I think if you have the silly hawk personality trait, you can just joke your way past this, but... You're in my way. We're under attack! <laughs> On your guard! Right there. That was a cross-class combo. That was another cross-class combo. Basically, Brit frozen enemies are vulnerable to the brittle status. And staggered enemies are vulnerable to my chain lightning and my advanced hemorrhage ability. Stuff like that. All right, what the heck am I supposed to do? Whoa!
that's just rude. What are they trying to do? Ruin my boots. This is some potent stuff. You could wipe out all of Hightown with just one vial. And that's Martin's dirty little secret. That's that. And honestly, I have no idea how long this is going to go for. Because... It's really easy to go and look at... My adventures from that perspective, but I don't know. The alienage is overcrowded. Someone should do something. Spank is a drug. All right, then. What are you going to do? Make a sigh. All right, Martin. You're smuggling poison. I thought you were trying to change your ways. I got the stuff from a legitimate supplier, and I'm going to sell it through legitimate channels. It's all legitimate. It's poison. It kills people. I just sell it. I'm not responsible for what people do with it. So, where is it? I mean, I found a literal treasure chest of poison earlier. And, on the same logic, people who sell me deadly weapons like the Final Thought, and whatever this thing Carver's carrying, are not responsible for what I choose to do with it. Do you know where Alton Woodrow's <coughs> place is? Merchant Woodrow's place. I know it. Thanks for this, friend. You've more than earned your reward. I'm gonna get my goods. You come back once I'm set up, I'll give you a discount. Straight up, this is also the most moral way to do it. Because everyone has to make a living in this day and age now. No need to be stingy and self-righteous over it. That's silly. Let's see. Da, 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 da. <clears throat> Rune of aggression increases threat generation. Use attack. Yeah, finally. Really. The armor shop. Rune of fatality. Health regen. All right. <clears throat> I'm sure you're paranoid, and that Knight Commander Meredith is not as crazy. Crazy pants. But yeah, in case you're wondering, this is the exact same map that we were in at the prologue. <laughs> the exact same map. So basically, we're at the gallows in the first place. Uh. I'm so worried they'd never let us past here. This is yours, if I'm not mistaken. Where did you get this? It's just... Hello there. Ah, welcome, my dear friend, to Sol's shop. My name is Solivitus. Please, take a look around. 
My apologies in advance. Our shelves are a bit bare at the moment. Actually, if you're interested, I could use a bit of help to remedy that. Nice. <laughs> remedy that. Potions shop. <laughs> you, my good man, are priceless. The pun wasn't intentional, although I may use that next time. Hey, man, go for it. Everyone's got something they need to do, and let's help out some businesses. For my creations are, of course, Business elsewhere. Uh, perhaps you could find yeah. them. You'll be Shit, compensated I mean, for your time, have no fear. Oh, I'll wait. also give you first pick of my new creations. Make up a list of what you need. And yeah, you can come here if you want in order to do this. So since you have the Dragon Fang, this is the like the only guy that knows how to do anything with it. Herbalist Task. Giant Spire Silk Gland. Bring the Fang to Solvis. Pure Iron Park. Okay. A Formari Herbalist. Restoration potions are not what you think they are. Since they also quite literally um, heal your injuries. Rune of Shadow. Welcome back to Sol, my friend. Mage Goods. Two elixirs of arcane techniques and three pure lyrium. You know what? I'll buy one. I don't know if I'm even going to use these elixirs of arcane techniques. It's weird. Alright. Okay, so I need to become a spirit mage. I have a question then. Bethany, can you use it? Hmm. Alright then. Oh! You have Summoner anyway. Interesting. <clears throat> it's not so bad. Very interesting. Island, a crafter for this clan, forced to stay and so close, close to this stinking shovelin city. city. I've seen my share of outsiders pass through our camp. Is there something you needed? Yeah. Do you have any pure iron bark in stock? What use is iron bark to you? I've never met a shem who could bend it to his will. Either way, I'm out of stock. I do know where it can be found, but it is impossible to retrieve. Our people were forbidden from venturing to the area. After we lost two of our best hunters there. What's the problem? Maybe I can give you a hand dealing with it. I find it insulting that you think you would succeed. Yada yada. Is overrun by dark spawn. If we tried to eradicate them, we would risk the precious few hunters we have left. I'll show you where the area is. What you do with the information is up to you. Is this safe? I thought the Dalish kill outsiders. All right. 
So we'll leave the area f through here. I, j I keep forgetting that you can leave the area from here. Uh, I gotta be honest. Alright, I work there. Why not? Looks like a fight. Be ready. Another soul. Nice leader. Iron bark clearing. Which we're not leaving until we should get some iron bark. You're not getting away with that. Yeah, stagger. There we go. You were staggered, so that happened. Chain lightning. And now the iron bark shows itself. But that's we're not gonna go back to the herbless task stuff right now. I think I found something of yours. You found this? I don't know what to say. Good luck getting 